Okay, so I'm going to show you how to make your very own customized logos, carrier logos for your iPhone Edge or iPhone 3G. This does not work on iPods. Okay? So, well, I don't know how to make it for iPods anyways. You're going to go to cooltext.com. You're going to choose, the, choose whatever style you want. Do not choose animated glow or burning because they don't work. I'm going to pick alien glow. Yeah, it looks good. It uh, I'm gonna pick, well. and then you type what you want. I'm gonna do that. By the way, read the description uh, box, the more info box. I'll have all the links for whatever you need there. Here's your gonna your font style. Uh, I'm gonna pick anything. I'm just gonna do this video very quickly. Uh, okay, this one looks interesting. Okay. And then these three colors right here, those are the only ones you're going to change. And so I'll, I'll show you how these three go colors are. This, the green is the first one, this black outline is the second color, this gray in the middle is the third one. So as you can see, first, second, third. Alright, I'm going to leave it like this. You change it to whatever you want, only these three colors though. This one you're going to leave alone and this you're going to leave alone. This file format, you're going to change it to PNG with transparency. Then you're going to render. And then, if you like how it turned out, if you don't like how it turned out, you edit the, the logo. If you like it, download it. Save it. Okay? It's fast, by the way. Uh, then you're going to go to GIMP or Photoshop, whichever one you will have. You're gonna open. You're gonna look for it. So mine is right there. I'm gonna open it. Next, you're gonna go to image, and then you're gonna change the image size to 50. Uh, the width, actually, the width will be 50. The height will be 20. Make sure constraint proportion. Constraint proportion is unchecked. Then you're going to click OK, and you can see as it got smaller. Um, then, uh, you can stretch it so that it, it'll... Because you want this to fit the, be, uh, fit the whole box as much as possible. And so that's why you're going to have to stretch it a bit. Grab the corners because it keeps the proportions the same. So there. Then you just go right here, click, then press apply. Then you're going to go to file, save as. Uh, it'll be on PNG. PNG format. The name, you're going to have to make two, two of these, by the way. The name will be default, capital D, E, F, A, U, L, T, underscore, uh, carrier, C, A, R, R, I, E, R. Carrier has to be all in caps. Then you're going to press underscore. And your carrier company, T-Mobile, uh, AT&T, O2, Orange, Rogers, or Fido, whatever. And by the way, they have to be all in capitals. So I'm going to do AT&T just because it's American and... Most YouTubes, YouTubers are American, I would assume. I'm Canadian. Um, you're gonna, then you're going to save it. You're going to press OK. Then you're going to make another one. OK. So again, PNG. And right here, you're going to name it F S O capitals all in capitals and then you're going to write carrier and then underscore AT&T again hit enter enter again make sure that says it says none that there's no interlace then you're going to go to your desktop the Wii is the best version, by the way. You're going to make a folder. Mortal Kombat Armageddon, a super fun feature-packed Wii You're going to name this folder... Kombat character you could ever want. Com. Till the next one. 
That's C-O-M dot A-P-P-L-E dot, uh, hold on, let me see this. Okay. So, it'll be C-O-M dot A-P-P-L-E. A so C O M dot A P P L E dot whatever your carrier logo is. So I'll put A T and T. And A T and T has to be in capitals, by the way. And then you're gonna hit enter. Sorry, don't hit enter yet. Oh, if you're under T-Mobile, make sure the T and the M is capital. And then the rest can be small. And I guess orange will be capital O and the rest small. Rogers is capital R. For Fido, it's capital F. So, after AT&T, after your carrier's name, you're going to press underscore dot US for the US and UK for UK. CA for Canada and they have to be in lowercase so small u small s so it should look like that com dot apple dot at and t or whatever underscore us or uk or ca then you're gonna make another folder you're gonna name it bundles capital B U N D L E S like that then you're gonna grab the folder you originally made, you're gonna drag it into bundles. Then you're gonna make another folder and you name it whatever you want. Logo. And then you drag it in there. You drag it into logos. Then you're gonna SSH your phone. If you don't know how to SSH, I'll have a video. You're gonna click back once. You're gonna go down to stash and if you have winter you need winter board by the way you're gonna gra grab logo you're gonna grab your folder you made and you're gonna drag it into themes now I'm not gonna do this because I made it for mine already and that's all you do after you do that you open up your winter board and it'll be in there I have my own theme uh, I'll show you my very own theme I have a Gears theme, it's right there. Gears of the War 2 theme. And so check mark it. And then just whatever, exit Winterboard, and then when it loads up, it loads up, you'll have it. By the way, please subscribe, I'll be making videos on how to completely customize your iPhone. I'll have images for everything. Thanks for watching and message, uh, please subscribe and rate. Rate it 5 out of 5. Thanks.